It's time for Mary Scully and our weekly point of view. I didn't go to Charlotte for the big race weekend, but instead settled into a comfortable chair to watch the Bush Series race from Lowe's Motor Speedway on TV. The Bush race at Charlotte featured so many cup racers that it sure looked like a top tier race to me. More than a third of the drivers were cup regulars. There has been so much bushwhacking this year by cup drivers that these more experienced drivers have essentially taken over the lesser series. A year or so ago, I said in a commentary that this was all right, that NASCAR shouldn't limit the races a driver can run. I believed then that drivers with NASCAR licenses should be allowed to race in any event if they can qualify for it. But the bushwhacking is so excessive in 2005 that I've changed my mind. During the first 16 races of this season, eight cup drivers won bush races. Add Carl Edwards, who is doing double duty in bush and cup, and has won three bush races, and you have 11 wins by cup drivers. That's more than half. Something has to change. Moonlighting racers in any of NASCAR's top three tiers should get no points when they race and proportionally less money than the regulars in those series. I'm Mary Scully, editor of Racing Milestones Magazine, and that's my point of view.